Hey folks, Jane here, and welcome back to the Funny Farm in Stardew Valley. It's a particularly cold morning today. Uh, but that's that's fine, you know. It's 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 midway through the season. It's supposed to be cold. Everyone's source of news, weather, and entertainment. But well, folks, it's gonna snow tomorrow. That's good. I love the snow. Uh, sorry if I sound a little out of it. I got I didn't get too much sleep last night. It's a little bit of a restless sleep. Ah, uh, yeah, neutral today. Cool. What's how does the Queen of Sauce have to say? Greetings, it is I, the Queen of Sauce, here to teach you a new mouth watering recipe from my secret cookbook. This week's dish, chocolate cake. Oh yeah, that's the best thing ever. These cold winter nights and digging your way through a rich chocolate mountain. With my help, you'll be well on your way to creating the finest cake you've ever laid eyes on. Now, you're going to need a lot of sugar. <laughs> cool. I like that. That's that's nice. Whoa! Hey, Jane. Guess what? My band is playing a show tonight in Zuzu City. Oh, that's the city I came from. Is it in? Is it in Town Center? Get the bus stop around four this afternoon to leave for the show. You better be there. I'm gonna be there. Don't even worry about that. God, I've played too many shows at Town Center. It's not actually like the center of town. It's just that's what the club is called. Uh, you're such a good neighbor. I thought I'd send over some animal feed to make your job easier. Keep it up, Marnie. Oh wow, thank you, Marnie. That's great. I love it. I love it a lot. All right, so we gotta keep in mind that we gotta be we gotta head out of here around four. Let's talk to the chickens and the duck. Bark, bark. Bark, 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 bark. Quack. <laughs> I love it. All right. You know what, Marty? This actually does make my job easier. Thank you. Can I put it back? Can I put it back by chance? I guess I, I'm just holding on to that forever. All right. Let's put the... Uh, Let's put this in here. Boink. Perfect. Say hi to Tasty Jams. <gasps> oh my god! This is the best day of all time! Tasty Jams loves me! Ha! <laughs> oh, that's good. I love... I am in love with today. Today is the best day of all time. Uh, let's see what we can do here. Uh, not a lot. Not a lot of ways to make money today. But hey, no, no complaints. Ah. It just had to be today that I got no sleep last night. Oh, it's gonna be a long one. A good one, though. I can, I can already feel how amazing today is gonna be. I mean, we got the show. Tasty Jam loves us. We didn't get a duck egg, but hey, we got some maple. You know, give that to people. Let's go around town, talk to everyone. Let's make it a social day. See who's available, who's up and who's about, and all that sort of stuff. Let's give people the flowers. Some people say I should have been a singer. I disagree. I'm fine as a DJ. Well, I mean, I was. Crap. What is my life right now? I'm a friggin' farmer in the middle of a small town. Like, what, do you even expect to be here a year for, a year ago? Or do you see yourself a year from now? I've been trying to keep our place clean, but it always gets messy again. It's hard to run a house all by yourself. I can, I can imagine that one. Um, have some, have a flower. Thank you, this looks special. It is. I picked it specifically to give to people, and you are our people. And I like you a lot, Penny. It seems that these two are either still sleeping or not in. So I'm gonna go... I'm gonna go talk to Sam. Give him a pizza. Damn it, everyone's asleep! I'm way too early today! I got a... I got a head start and it was too early. Hi, Penny. Yeah! Dude, I'm totally gonna... I'm totally gonna make... Sam is going to be my boyfriend today, and then I will be dating you and him at the same time, and it's going to be the best life ever. Thank you for understanding, Penny. She understands. I don't know why she wouldn't. Right, it's Sunday, so let's go buy some stuff. Let's go see what the floors look like. Hey, Pierre, what do you got for me today? 
Ooh, nice kitchen floor. I'll take it. I'll take it. Mayonnaise. Can I not sell the maple here? That's a damn shame. Hmm. You know, I'm, I'm sort of getting a run with these. So I'm going to sell them. Ooh, that'd be pretty good. That's a pizza. I need that pizza, though. I need it. Alright, it's ten now. Which means we can go say hi to people. Let's go say hi to Alex. I haven't talked to him in a while. Whoa! Hey, George. Aren't you cold? They don't make sweaters like they used to. This vest is very, very nice. <sighs> what? You like some maple? Thanks. It's it's uh, homegrown on my farm. Hello, Evelyn. How are you doing this morning? You should make some hot soup to stay warm. As I told your husband, I mean, I got this insulating vest. It's very good. And make sure you wear a jacket. It's like they don't even listen to me. Would you also like some maple? Oh my, it looks wonderful. That's very kind of you. They both love my maple syrup. I made it, and they got it. I wonder where Alex got off to. I should put it in my kitchen floor before it's too late, but... Uh, yeah, I'm not just gonna talk to everyone today. It's a good day to talk to people. It's a great day to talk to people, in fact. Oh, oh, hold on, hold on. Getting a brainwave here. I've been meaning to give, uh, Sam the bouquet for a while, and all of a sudden, it's time. But I don't want to jump the gun and give it to him early today, so I gotta... I gotta be patient on this one. I gotta... Yeah, here we go. And don't. Oh, that is so nice! Holy crap! My house looks great. Are you kidding? Uh, yeah, let's make some pancakes and give it to somebody. Let's give the pancakes to a person. Also, let's sell the mayonnaise here. I love you. Great cat. Don't. Yeah, it's, uh, so here's what I'm thinking here. Here's what I'm thinking. I go to Sam's show, and obviously I'm going to love it because, you know, he's, he's a great musician. I've heard him play when he's, when he's practicing. Uh, I'm going to like the show, but he doesn't know that I've been planning to make him my boyfriend. Or rather, he has. I haven't exactly been subtle. Either way, I'm going to give him the bouquet after the show, and it's going to be the best. Yeah, there he is. Hey, Vin. Hi there, miss. Are you doing good? Have yourself a flower. For me? Wow, thanks. You're welcome. I love people. Everybody is good today. There you go. Oh, yeah, it's my absolute favorite. I know, right? Sam is busy practicing the guitar. Clearly for his show later. Computer say. Sans computer, he's got an extensive library of computer games. This is why I love him. He is clearly the best of all of us. Sam is best. Right, so it's 1 p.m. Let's go say hi to Leah and Marnie. And uh, continue the day. Maybe Leah will love some pancakes. Who knows? Who knows? Hello. Do you ever take a whole day off? I can't say I have in the recent past. I used to all the time back when I lived in the city, but eh. It's a refreshing break. I'd say. I'd definitely say so, but um, eh, let's give you the flower. This is a really nice gift. Thank you. You're welcome. Enjoy it. I was gonna turn back and tell her that, but I had already walked out the door by the time I got the chance to do so. Which is a shame. Go in the, go in the door. Hey! How are you doing today? Hey there, it's good to see you. Oh, thank you. Feel free to visit anytime you please. I most certainly will take you up on that offer. Would you like some pancakes? Thank you. I made them myself. I believe... Uh, how, how do you make pancakes? I didn't actually check. Going... Ooh, another book. Yeah, I should go check out the library while I still got the rest of the day. I got two books in there. Screw it. But yeah, I'm pretty sure uh, pancakes take an egg. Which is cool. Uh, it takes flour, definitely. 
Hey, Abigail. How are you doing today? Oh, hello. Made these two drawings. What do you think? I don't know. Uh, okay. I like the jungle island and the tiger. I like the orc with the battle axe. I don't like either of them. Um, well, I can't actually see them, so I can't really make a definitive uh, judgment, but... Um, I'm kind of a scenery type of person. I'll take that one. Oh, yeah? I guess that makes sense. <laughs> yeah, I expected that from you. Jane, you weirdo. Like in tigers. I wonder what she's doing with her two drawings. Just carrying them around. Oh, well. The works the battle axe is cool. I love scenery shots, though. They're some of the best. Like, you get a perfect sunset. Oh, God. It makes it makes the best day even better. Let's see what this book is about. Brewmaster's Guide. Ah, to brew. Oh, well, it doesn't say who did it. The rich smell of yeast wafting through a seat of raft. Flurve turns you freshly cut hops on a winter's eve. Better digress. Uh, you are probably more interested in practice that brewing. To brew, you need keg. Leave that to you. Benefits for keg. Kegs are used to make several kinds of product. Uh, vegetables placed inside. Keg would produce juice. Produce juice and brew. Uh, juice takes the least amount of time to brew. Okay. If if we is placed in keg, it would produce beer. Beer takes a while to brew, but it's quite powerful. But Placing perhaps in the keg would produce beloved pale ale. Place fruit in keg and make wine. Why takes the longest of all to make? But wine made from a fruit's fruit this is, this is worth of quite a bit. Be patient with keg, even though it's finished when it's perfect still. And only drink in moderation if you, you'll surely regret it otherwise. Cool. That's, uh, that's some damn useful information right there. Mysteries of the Dwarves. The Dwarves call themselves Smaluanu, which translates to Sky People, an odd name for a group that lives deep underground, isn't it? Another mystery of the Dwarves is the advanced technology they supposedly possess. Evidence such as this has le had led me, uh, despite the ridicule of my colleagues, to produce a new theory. I believe the Dwarves are remnants of a once advanced civilization whose interplanetary vehicle crashed on this planet long ago. I propose that this dwarf spaceship bore down deep underground, and over time the dwarves became adapted to the new underground environment. My colleagues ask, why didn't they come from uh, above ground and live on the surface? Perhaps their old planet had a thicker atmosphere. Why didn't they come above ground and live on the surface? Uh, that protected them from stellar radiation. They And they simply could not survive in our sunlight. That would explain why they, are only sur they only surface at night to take what they need from our houses. Oh, Dwarf Thieves, M. Jasper. M. Jasper is a is a very knowledgeable person. Not much to say on the matter, just knowledgeable. Knowledgeable M. Jasper. Jasper, whatever. You know what I meant. Hey, let's get you going. Point. <gasps> Copper, it's the best. Okay. Uh, just enjoy the walking through the snow. It's a good feeling. Hey, Mero, what's up? It's so sleepy when it's cold. I know exactly how you feel. Though, I... I don't get sleepy in... Well, I was gonna say, in the summertime, I don't really get sleepy so much as, uh, I lose energy. I just wanna, like, veg out, I guess. It's almost four o'clock. That means it's time. Wait for it. Ah, uh, yeah, there we go. All right, everyone in town is apparently going. Oh, I should have put my bow on my hair first. Hi, hey, Jane, thanks for coming. Anything, man, I'd be down. I'd be there for you. I'll be there for you. Uh, our gear's loaded already. Let's get every. Let's, looks like everyone's set. All right, everyone, let's get in the bus. The broken ass bus. Whoa, it's no time. I'm starting to get really nervous. Wow, his face! <laughs> oh, that's, that's funny. Hey, Sam, don't get nervous. It's just like practicing in your room. Except better. Okay, here we go. Wish me luck. It's better because people get to cheer you. Whoa, that was, that was peculiar. Oh. Hi everyone from Pelican Town. Uh, we're called Xenon Chip 3.0. 
Interesting name. Here we go. Sweet. Huh. I like the Abigail hair wave there. That's pretty cool. Yeah! I like the green haired dude just head bobbing. This guy. <laughs> Yeah, honestly, I, I sort of understand why people get stage fright, but the image of people cheering you on, oh, it, it gives me, it gives me life. Wow, those electronic sounds are far out. Thank you, Emily. <laughs> nice work, guys. I really enjoyed that bass part. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, everyone. But you should really be clapping for Jane. Without her help, we would have never dedicated what kind of music. Decide what kind of music to make in the first place. Yeah! Cheer me up! <laughs> sure like an honorary member of the band, then. I would have liked to be part of the actual band, but hey, you know what? No problem. Oh, don't forget to pick up one of our uh, demo cassettes on the way out. Only 10G. That is cheap! Sam, you gotta, you, gotta, you gotta charge more for that. That was awesome, though. I love that. That went well. Thanks again for coming with us. I wouldn't miss it for everything in the world. And it's still 4 p.m. <laughs> oh, that's that's great. I love that. Well, time to go give Sam the bouquet. It's time, guys. It's time. Where is he? He deserves it. He earned it today. <laughs> Where's your brother at? Is he still inside practicing? As he's off to do. No, I've already talked to you, apparently. No, he's out, He's elsewhere. Sam is out and about. I need to go find him. Give him this bouquet. Where is your son? If I was rich, the first thing I would do would be hire a maid and a chef. I'm down with that. My goodness, that would be nice. Yeah, right? It'd be great. Um, it's Sunday, so where the hell could he be? Where does Sam go? Talk to both of you. Seems Pam is in the bar already. The saloon. Star Drop Saloon. Oh, damn! It's called the Star Drop Saloon? <laughs> I just realized. Blech. My front yard's a mess. I mean, Penny, Penny tries. My sister and I might fight sometimes, but I really miss her if she left. Is she planning on leaving? I think she'll become a very nice young lady someday. Don't tell her I said that. <laughs> So, is there anything you want to talk about? Not particularly. Thank you, though, Emily. Business has been pretty steady, I think, to my regular customers. Cool. All right, Sam, in front of the whole bar, I'm gonna make you my boyfriend. Oh, wait, hold on. Got stuff to say for you. Hey, the show was a great success. Thanks again, Gene. No problem, man. I love you. <gasps> I'll accept this, thank you. Ah, he's blushing. Adorable. I didn't know you felt the same. Yes! Ooh, 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 ooh. We're gonna make the sweetest of music. Shane, guess what I did? Mm, 6 p.m. Should I throw a frozen in the microwave or should I wait? I don't care, dude. Sam's my boyfriend, Penny's my girlfriend. I live the fucking life in, in Stardew Valley. I'm just gonna walk with you here. Be annoying. Yeah, you know, how, you know how it goes. Yeah, I live the damn life. Everything is awesome, okay? Like, don't even get me started on the farming, which gets me some money, not a lot, but it gets me some, which is pretty cool. And that's a steady gig going on. And also, I got two of the greatest uh, people in my life, and also the rest of the town is pretty cool. You're awesome. Don't get me even started on you. Love you, man. You're cool. And also, friggin'... I go, whoop. I had to look over there at the bear for a second. It was a nice bear. 
Man, Stardew Valley is awesome. I can't believe it took me so long to get out here. I was out here once with my, when I visited my grandpa uh, back in the day. But, you know, he passed away, so... Uh, yeah. Oh, God, I love it here. I, you should stick around after you're, uh... After you, after you, you know, stick around for a while. You just stick around, you know? Hang out. Have a, have the good life. It's a good life here in this small town. You, me, and Leah, we should just, uh, we should just chill. Be like, hey, uh, we're, we're not originally from here, but you know what? We don't care. And I guess Elliot, too. He isn't from here either, is he? Whatever. But the four of us should have, like, uh, we came from out of town sort of club. I'll run it by the other two, but what do you think? You, you down with that? Hmm. Yeah, I'll, I'll let you think on that. I'll be back. Oh, Harvey. I hate to say this, but I do make a lot more money during flu season. Hey, don't don't be don't be hating on me, money man. I guess if people stopped getting sick, I'd be out of business. Exactly. Uh, don't get the wrong idea. I want people to be healthy, really. Well, I mean, you wouldn't be a good, very good doctor if you didn't. Don't you have work to do? What? You got a problem? I'm having a good day. Don't ruin it for me. I need a little warm me up to be ready for another cold night of the ocean. As you do. I've already talked to you today, apparently. Wow, today was the best. Man, I can't believe I have a boyfriend and a girlfriend. I am the luckiest girl in the world right now. And everything is awesome. Like, everything is awesome. It is the best of the best, and don't even get me started on how awesome it is. Truly. Truly and for real awesome. So, I guess I'll hit the hay early tonight. You know, try and get more sleep so tomorrow I'll be in a better mood. It's gonna be great. I can just feel it. Alright. I cannot get that song stuck out of my head. Sam, you made an ear tick out of this. It's good. I should really should have worn my butterfly bow for it. Oh well. Right, there's no there's no bouquet here anymore, so I don't have to worry about it. And I'm gonna get rid of my hops, I'll just put the butterfly bow there. I do need another keg though. How do you make a keg? I forget. Wasn't I gifted that one? Oh yeah, you need oak resin, that's the problem. I'm waiting for this oak tree to grow. Let's see if we got any more maple and then hit the sack. Call it a quick call it a quick and easy night. Yeah, nothing going on. Oh wait! That's going on. Perfect. All right, let's get it going. Let's go to sleep. Pass out. Wow, today was awesome. All right, let's go. Let's go to bed. Ah oh, man, I love the floor too. Today's just been an overall good day. Hey Jams, you love me. That was foreboding. Yeah, there it is. All right, thank you guys so much for visiting me on the farm today. I've been Jane. You've been great, too. And today has been awesome. Don't ever change yourselves, though, because you're pretty awesome, too. Have yourself a delightful day. See how much we made. i got to stop doing the outro before I check out the money. All right, well, as I said, thank you. Goodbye.